guys I got a quick treat for you today we are making a sandwich spread it is going I don't know what to call it an Italian sandwich spread um, a pickled pepper and onion sandwich spread I don't know not sure what the title is gonna be but this is going to be delicious I got the idea from a recipe that I saw where they took some type of brand of pickled um, onions and peppers and jalapenos and cauliflower and celery and they made a spread with it we're gonna do something similar except we are using my home canned um, pickled peppers and onions and this is from um, I think they're Cuban style it's from the ball um, one of the ball canning books I believe the new one and it had this recipe in it and I tried it and I loved it so that is what we're using today now save the juice because that is how I'm going to make my chick-fil-a style chicken sandwiches and if you want to see that video let me know down in the comment section because it is divine and it does taste well my husband says it tastes better than Chick-fil-A. So this is going to go in the fridge to await that recipe. In here I have about a half a cup, maybe three quarters of a cup of mayonnaise. And then I'm going to put my peppers in here and they already have all kinds of spices. You can see the pepper flakes in there. And if you didn't want it spicy, then don't add the spice, but I like mine with a kick. Literally, all we do these two ingredients, and then we blend it until the consistency that we like. Now, I want it to still have some chunks in it, but I want it to be spreadable. that I want and we're gonna taste it and see if we want it a little thicker oh, yeah. Yeah. give it a nice stir and a taste oh my goodness that is so good I do want to add excuse me tiny bit more mayonnaise To make it a little thicker. Oh, baby got the tripod. Oh, this is for my friend and subscriber. Here's one, baby. Say hi. And then there's the other baby. There's my sneak peek for you. You know who you are. You know who you are. That was just for you. Now. Oh yeah, that makes it perfect. Yeah. So here is well, come here. So here is the consistency. So we added about a cup for a pint of my um, canned pickles and onions, and I don't think I did a video on that. But I only have one jar left, so I'll be doing a video. But there it is. So you can see it's still chunky. But it's not, uh, or it's still spreadable. It's chunky, but spreadable. It's perfect. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Super quick, super easy, and this will make chicken, beef, pork alike. No. Even better as a sandwich, now that we have this spread. It will probably even be good on just a cheese sandwich oh, yeah. or a veggie sandwich. Oh, yeah. The possibilities are endless. All right, guys. So until next time, thanks for watching.